what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Should schools reopen this fall, Barron Trump will not be attending like a normal child. Despite a huge push to reopen by his daddy, Donald Trump, your president. So what's behind all this? Heard somebody say, oh, you're trying to, it's, the headline is misleading. It's misleading. No, it's not. It is what it is. Well, you know, uh, he can't go back to school uh, if, if his private school that he attends refuses to reopen. Eh. Are they refusing to reopen or were they told to not reopen? You understand what I'm saying? He's the president of the United States. He got a lot of juice. Plus he's a coward. Afraid to get in there and get into the get dirty, get his hands dirty like the rest of us. Keep in mind, we're talking about a draft dodger. Ain't nothing worse than a draft dodger in the United States of America. Even worse, a white draft dodger. I'm talking about with all of these privileges and rights and, 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 and honors that they have here in America, to be a draft dodger and white? Do you know how despicable you would have to be I know some of you can't tell because, you know, he has a lot of support from his constituency. He has a lot of support. Don't know how, because those are the same people that get upset when you start talking about patriotism. But they back a man who, who, was, who refused to fight for this same patriotism five times. Help me make that make sense, fam, because I can't do it all by myself. How does a man who love a country so much, who gets so many rights, born in the privilege, how does he refuse to fight for a country that he calls so great? None of them can figure out that they've been hustled. I mean, just on a rudimentary level. You can't figure that out. You've been hustled. This dude won't fight himself. Won't, wouldn't, refuse to, to go and serve. Refuse to serve in the military. But he'll send you out there on a tour real fast. He'll send your, your child, your brother, your mother, your sister, your family member in a heartbeat. Do you see a parallel here? Do you see a, a corresponding parallel here? Uh, here where you have his son, now you got everybody else is going to be at risk. Anybody go back to school in the fall, your children are going to be at risk. Guaranteed. His child is going to be safe, chilling in the White House, playing on, on a floor all by himself, kicking it. Nurses and the ambulances on standby, paramedics. Federal agents. He's, he's going to be straight. Barron is going to be good, but your child is going to be at risk. He's telling you, oh, it's safe enough to return, but my kid ain't going. I refuse to believe that he didn't have some influence over that school not reopening because a lot of the private schools are going to reopen. Private schools, they need that money more than the public schools. So they would be the first to reopen. They're not getting a ton of money from the government. Come on, fam. Come on. Where my critical thinkers at? If Barron 
school refuses to open, it is because, well, it is my belief that Trump has some influence. His son won't go get his hands dirty. He won't get in the trenches with the people. Is anyone surprised? His daddy wouldn't get in the trenches with the people. His daughter ain't gonna get in the trenches with the people. They ain't gonna step back and be safe. They gonna do what they gotta do from a safe distance and send everybody else out there to be at risk. That's the way they operate. And for the ones who are out there who claim to support them, you don't see anything wrong with that? Basically what you tell me is that they're better than your children. They're better than you. That's what you're telling me. If you're okay with that, you're telling me that Donald Trump's child is better than your child. You're telling me that Donald Trump is better than you. I don't give a damn if Donald Trump is the president of the United States of America. I'm Willie D. And as far as I'm concerned, the lives of me and my kids are far more valuable than the life of his and his kids. No more talk. What the talking about.